everyone, it's me, YD28. Welcome back to my channel, The Sims 2. Let's play a Desiderata Valley, round five. And we're back with the Picasso family. And we're starting off the part with a birth. What a way to start a part. <laughs> oh, we waited forever, last part. Um, and now we're going to get to spend the whole part with the newborn baby. So I'm pretty freaking excited. Oh, I was partially expecting twins. Partially. Uh, our bed just disappeared. Holy. Baby looks like Matthew. Oh, we had a boy! Look at her face. She's so freaking happy. I'm so happy for the Picassos. Okay, cool. So you guys gave me some really, really great names. You guys love their last name and we're having such fun. Um, but the name I think I want to go with is... Uh, actually, I have a bunch of Dylans in my Pleasant View one. Let's go with Robbie. Robbie Picasso or Rob Picasso. Um... We should call him Rob, because when he's older, it's going to be, like, super awkward. But we'll call him Robbie. Don't worry. So he's Rob Picasso. And um, I think he's so cute. He's adorable. Hooray. Can we um come see a baby? Yes. Can we, uh, can we talk to baby? No, you are not going to work. Okay. Hold. Hold the baby. There we go. Good. And then talk to baby Rob. I want this moment, please. And they're both in their work out outfit. So this is just freaking perfect. Hang on. Is this a good angle? Is this a good angle? Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness, they're both adorable. Yeah, Jessica, you're not going to work. Pretty sure we're going to be having you uh, quit your job. Um, because we don't really need you to be working anymore. So I think that's what we'll do. He starts work at 9, and he needs a mechanical skill point. So I'm going to have him come and uh, get that. And then um, Jessica's going to spend the time with her baby. <laughs> And we'll put him in his crib over here. And all will be well in the world, you know? I'm so excited. I can't believe they had a baby boy. How many babies do we want? Oh, it doesn't really matter. But, um, yes, in terms of uh, Jessica and Matthew's relationship. Um, so she is attracted to John Mole. John Mole's attracted to her. Um, surprisingly, she doesn't have, um, double lightning bolts with Matthew, which really, like, confuses me. Um, but, therefore, they're, uh, fa hang on, my cat's yowling. Yeah, sorry, I don't know, sometimes my cat, my cat doesn't, like, meow or yowl a lot. Um, so when he does, I'm just like, what's, what's wrong? <laughs> like, what's going on? Um, but he was just lonely, because the dog is down here with me, so. My cat's a weirdo. <laughs> but I love him. Anyways, um, so yeah, we're going to have Jessica, uh, clean the house and be like a good, good, um, housewife. And I think we will, um... Well, we have three vacation days. So as soon as our vacation days are over, we're going to um, give notice to our job. And that will, uh, that will be that. So I'm really excited. And then her hair can come down out of this bun, and she can uh, be a little more free-flowing and things like that. So that's exciting. Um, he did not get his mechanical point, but he's going to take his pickup truck to work. Um, I kind of want him to still use the carpool, just because military, it, like, makes sense. I feel like if you're in the military specifically, you wouldn't take your own car into work. Is, is that just me? I could be completely off. Like, maybe I can drive your own car into, uh, into the base, but I don't think you can. 
I'm not sure. So, uh, yeah, we're going to just do some cleaning and take care of our baby and um, get some leftovers. Now we're not feeling quite so upset, but the phones are ringing, so let's see what's up with that. No, Matthew's not available to talk. He left, so, you know. Uh, we need to fill this in. We need to then uh, see what's in the leftovers because I actually don't know. Oh god! And the mailman came and gave us some bills. That's freaking fantastic. But let's see what we can eat. Toaster pastry, perfect. Can I compost the newspaper? Yes. Uh, we'll just compost them both. It's fine. And then we have um, the diaper. Uh, lunchtime, Matthew heads out. Eat the salmon for its fitness benefits or just stick with the carb-laden... I'll eat the fish. Oh, damn it. Oopsie daisies. Okay, cool. So we're composting and composting. And then we're going to... Hold the poor baby and change his dirty diapy. And uh, play with him and cuddle him. Feed him a bottle. Maybe give him a bath in the sink because that's... Uh, I love that interaction. It's so cute even though it's like... It's not a necessity. Like you don't have to necessarily um, bathe them. Um, I don't know. I like it. It's cute. So anyways, um, and I'm wondering if we should try for another baby because I kind of want them all close in age together, similar to the Automuses. Um, they had a ton of kids. But what do I know? What do I know? And then we can put him back in his crib and, uh, it's two o'clock. We can, um... Just make ourselves uh, a lunch meat sandwich to eat. But yeah, this interaction is so freaking cute. Like, it gets me every single time. I wonder if I can get a good picture with the walls up. Oh, yes. Oh, there we go. Very good. Okay, cool. Very good, 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 good. Okay, and then he goes back in there, and we're going to make ourselves a lunch meat sandwich. Good. Um, and maybe work on our cleaning and cooking skills, although we're doing that slowly. But Matthew is home. I didn't make him anything. I forgot he was going to be home uh, at 3 o'clock. Uh, he brought home a friend, which is pretty... Uh, I, that's all right. <laughs> um... He wants to be friends with Julian Cook. He also wants to throw a party. Um, you know how I feel about Julian Cook, guys. You know how I feel about Julian Cook. But we'll give him a call. Uh, and invite him over, maybe for dinner or something. And, um, yeah, sure, your friend can come over too. I don't know which friend you're going to be bringing, but, you know, that's fine. She's already cleaning. Like, look at her. She's doing fine. Um... Did you bring this friend with you? This is the friend you brought? Okay. Who's this guy? Um, I don't know who this chick is. I think, uh, I think that's his employee. Julian, you dog. Okay, cool. So he's talking with us. We want to play with him a bit. Uh, maybe we'll toss a football around a bit and be like, Jessica's going to make us, uh, dinner in a little bit. Um, and, um... And yeah, and she's just going to, you know, be nice and um, chat with the uh, the ladies a bit. And she's kind of uh, nice looking. Do you guys uh, not toss a football? There we go. I probably shouldn't do it in front of the window like that, because I'm pretty sure that's how you break windows. <laughs> oh my goodness. And we want to admire him a bit. 
So yeah, we're just talking a little and it's five o'clock, so let's go ahead and surf up some spaghetti for dinner. Spaghetti's yummy. She's talking about woohoo, girl. I don't I do not want to talk about woohoo with you. Not like not really. <laughs> not really. And Rob is just sitting there being a good baby and she likes and it's always good. Okay, cool. That's enough tossing footballs. Oh, we're friends now. That's great. Okay, the two of them seem to really get along uh, well. Hmm. And we seem to like uh, we seem to like this Taylor girl a bit. Very good, very good. Okay, are you serving up the food? Okay, cool. So we're gonna come in and. Uh, Come and eat quickly. There we go. This is lovely. Oh my god, she just took his pasta. What a <laughs> he actually doesn't even really want to eat, so he's just going to sit and um, talk with everyone a bit. I know, yeah. Yes, stinky. Very good, very good. Um, yeah, and he wants to throw a party, but parties are awkward um, for him at this time because uh, we gotta go to bed so early, and he has work. And although he his work doesn't start too too early, we could uh, throw a party tomorrow maybe. Um, he doesn't know many people in the town. The, pe the person that knows more of the people is Jessica. And Jessica has pissed off a whole bunch of people lately. Um, but she's close with Hannah Bell a bit. We've gone over to her place um, a little. Fake out? Why do you want to fake me out? Okay, I'm going to just ignore you. Okay. Well, that was that. Uh, so I think we'll go ahead and we're gonna say goodbye to everyone because it's like 8.30. And uh, we all need to, we need to get going to bed and stuff. So uh, we're gonna put away leftovers and clean up the kitchen a bit. Because we did a whole bunch of cooking and stuff today and she wants to make sure that the place is, you know, in tip top shape. And then you, you need to study mechanical point because yeah, you need that. You need that for work. And then we're chilling uh, at the end of our day and just, you know, doing us. He has, Matthew has a sweater. I got Matthew a sweater that I want him to, uh, to wear. So as soon as he got, he gets this mechanical point. Go change Rob's diaper, honey. So funny, he just like leaves the baby crying in his crib for like ever. Oh my god. Okay. You can get it, you can get it. Yes, okay, cool. Very good. And then come up here, plan your outfit. Jessica, honey, you can take a shower and go to bed. Okay, cool. I got him a sweater as well because it's winter time, it's chilly. You should not be, um, you should not be in, uh, in a t-shirt. So I'm going to go ahead and skip until tomorrow. I will see you guys uh, then. And good morning, everyone. So we are uh, just chilling today. Uh, she wants to take a hike, um, but I don't think that's something we can do with um, the baby around. Um, not entirely sure. Uh, he's sleeping right now, though, and um, Matthew wants to go throw axes. Honey, how about you? Um, eat a toaster pastry before you have to go to work. There you go. And uh, so I have the carpool picking him up today. Um, just because I... It makes sense to me, but let me know if you guys have any preference. I don't think it matters all that much, but... <laughs> it's just for my sanity, you know? Uh, okay, cool. So we're picking up Rob. I think Rob's going to age up today or tomorrow so that'll be great and uh he has a stinky diaper so we'll cuddle with him and play with him 
And then we can put him in his crib and uh, clean up our kitchen a little bit. He keeps leaving books everywhere, so that's just freaking fantastic. And uh, clean this bathroom because, again, he makes like a freaking mess. Look at all the puddles he leaves. Like, it's insane. It is insane. And the shower, oh my god, and now the shower's broken too. Like, oh my goodness. Poor Jessica, she has her work cut out for her. Like, being a housewife is honestly a lot of work. Like, people think it's like a vacation. Like, no. You gotta, oh my god, she can't even repair it. She's gonna have to wait and have him repair it um, when he comes home. Which is fine. She's going to get some leftovers. I want her to study a bit more cooking and uh, cleaning too today. But she wants to do, um, she wants to hunt for some bugs. I don't think we're going to find bugs. Um, because, um, because it's winter time. But we could do bird watching. Oh my god, we're getting mauled. Oh my god, run inside. Oh my god! Oh my god, we're getting chased by bees! Oh my god! That was no fun! That was no fun at all. Zero fun. Zero fun that was. But Matthew just got promoted into senior officer. This guy looks like us. Like, that's really creepy. Oh my god! Oh my god, we could be cousins or something. Holy snap. Uh, we didn't bring home any friends from work, but we are now senior officer. You survived your airborne tour and made it to the brass. You're well respected and your counsel is often sought. More charisma training will improve your speeches and working out will help you maintain your fitness level. Work on these areas if you want to move on to commander. Oh, we do. Oh, we do want to move up to commander. Okay, cool. We want to throw a party. I think a party is a grand idea. <clears throat> and, um, yes, we're gonna do it. We're going to do it. Okay. Oh, so he has to repair the shower really, really quick while he's home. And you can change into your everyday. Um, Jessica's just chilling. She's like, oh, you're home. That's great. <laughs> oh, my goodness. I got just got chased by bees. It was no fun. Let's go bird watching really quickly for a little bit. Oh, and now she wants to interact with um, Matthew a whole bunch. She wants to talk with him and um, flirt with him and give him a back rub. He's um, He's been working so hard for our family, so we want to appreciate him. <laughs> oh, we know that. Oh, she's gossiping about John with him. Oh, my God. And we want to play with him. And all of that good stuff. And he doesn't care. He's going to throw the party soon, so. Let me uh, take the stress off your shoulders, baby. Just a little bit. And then let's save the makeout for uh, later tonight. Okay, cool. Can you come answer the phone? No, Jessica's not available to talk. Okay, cool. Uh, so we're going to go ahead and throw ourselves a house party. Uh, and we're going to invite, um, I guess, our co-workers and Julian Cook, Ivy Taylor, Isaac Bell, Hannah Bell, Louis Asper, Willow Jordan. We know a lot of random people. We don't know, like, the people <laughs> we want to know. Um, unfortunately. Cool, but he's excited. He wants to have a great party. Um, we don't even have a stereo in here, so I better fix that <laughs> really quickly. Um, I guess it can just go there. Okay, let's grab one. Da -da 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 -da. Now that we have a lot of money, I do have to really renovate this house and decorate it hardcore, so I'll do that off camera, though, because, you know, that's, um... It can be tedious, and I like, uh, I, I take a lot, I take a long time. Uh, so we're going to put on some pop music, not classical, not, um, 
uh, what was it? That was salsa. That was salsa music. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, cool. So, um, Julian came. We want to give him a hug. He's our, he's our buddy. He's our friend. Um, maybe we'll see if we can hook him up with, um, one of these girls here, because they're pretty cute. Um, we're gonna, we want to influence somebody to do what? Entertain someone else? Okay, so we can influence him to entertain Willow. Cool. And then we want to have a pillow fight with someone. We can have a pillow fight with Ivy. And Rob's birthday is only a day away. So I think we'll age him up uh, this evening uh, as well because that uh, sounds like fun. And I want to see what he looks like as a toddler. Um, and poor Jessica. She's just kind of like um, in the sides. Um, okay, we'll influence... Influence him to talk to Ivy. And, oh, we need food. So Jessica's going to come serve um, mac and cheese. I think that sounds fun. Be congratulated on what? Very good, very good. Don't touch my baby! What are you doing? What are you doing? I know, honey, you, there's, everyone's in the kitchen right now, and <laughs> you need to, you need to finish cooking, so everyone needs to get out of here. Okay, cool. Um, let's go here, let's do some dancing. Oh my god, I don't think you know how to dance. <laughs> he wants to dance with somebody, you should dance with your, uh, your wife, that would be good. Okay, my baby is, Rob, Rob's diaper is, like, wretched he needs he needs it to be changed so you need to you need to put him down so i can change his diaper cool okay so let's come grab a bowl and we're going to call guests to the meal so they'll come eat good and then jessica can change rob's diaper and i'm going to go ahead and grab a cake for him we can age him up because that would be great uh, but we seem to be doing okay Julian um, Julian and Matthew really get along I guess because they're both new to town they can um, they can really relate uh, Jessica's relationship with Julian she doesn't really have one she can oh she's kind of attracted to him um, same level with her uh, with Matthew though so you know apparently our party is a snoozer so that's um, that's pretty great. Okay, cool. Can we, um... I don't know why it's a snoozer of a party. Oh my god, can we dance together? How about you dance with, um... This guy instead. Okay, cool. Now it's not bad. Getting better. Okay, cool. Getting better. But we're going to come bring Rob to the cake. I really need this party to go well, though. We want to dance with Ivy, and we want to have a pillow fight with Ivy again. But it's your son's birthday. So come see him. I'm so excited to see what this child looks like as a toddler. So freaking pumped. So freaking pumped. Everyone's going to leave before he ages up. I think he's gonna look just like Matthew. He's gonna look just like Matthew. I have a feeling. Are we gonna have the cinematic? No. Ah! What? Why does he have such an evil look on his face? Why are his eyebrows like that? Wait, wait, let me see this child. Huh?
He doesn't look like either of them. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay. Um, I think I need to give them different eyebrows. So we're going to come change his appearance really, really quickly. I guess he has Jessica's nose. His eyebrows are like terrible though. Oh my god. Like, oh my gosh. And his ears are massive. Oh my god, they do not make good kids. They do not make good kids. <laughs> Let me just give him camouflage paint to like hide his face. <laughs> oh my gosh. This is no good. This is no good at all. Okay, cool. Well, she wants to have another baby, and um, so I think that's a fine idea. Let's put Rob here. We want to make out with Matthew a bit. And we'll come up to bed. He wants to go on a vacation, an island vacation. This is fine, but we're going to go ahead and uh, try for another baby. <laughs> oh god, it's one in the morning. Nope. They are not a fertile bunch, like, actually. Oh well. Anyways, uh, I'm going to go ahead and end this part here. If you guys are enjoying this series, please do give this video a fat thumbs up and subscribe for more as I put them out fairly regularly. Uh, let me know your thoughts on the family and how they're faring, um, despite the drama. And let me know what you think about little Rob here. He looks really, really evil. <laughs> Uh, oh, and I didn't even look at his traits and stuff, so uh, he's neat and active and playful and super nice. So he's actually, like, one of those people that, like, looks evil, but he's, um, you know, he's actually a nice guy. And he's into tinkering! Oh, that'll be fun. Okay, cool. So there you go. There's Rob. Okay. I love you guys so very much. I will see you in my next video. Bye, guys.